Welcome back to Chelsea News TV and today we are going to look at Chelsea now fly to Lisbon to complete the signing of World Cup Argentina winner and Benfica midfielder Enzo Fernandez. Chelsea have told Benfica they will pay Enzo Fernandez £106 million release clause in instalments as they look to secure his services before the January window closes, according to reports. Chelsea, who confirmed the £26.3 million signing of Malo Gusto from Lyon on Sunday, had an offer of around £75 million plus bonuses rejected for Fernandes earlier in the month. Therefore, the Premier League giants will travel to Portugal on Monday to host a new round of talks with Benfica and offer to pay the 22-year-old's £106 million release clause in instalments. According to Football, Chelsea are sending a body of representatives out to Lipsun to close a deal with Benfica before the January transfer window closes. Chelsea will reportedly offer to pay the 22-year-old's £106 million release clause in instalments as they are under pressure to finalise a deal within the next 48 hours. The decision comes after Benfica rejected Chelsea's previous offer of around £75 million plus bonuses earlier in the month. Chelsea had also saw a bid with £112 million to £6 million pounds more than his release clause rejected as it was structured to be paid in three installments. Benfica wanted the full release clause to be paid up front, instead of Chelsea's proposal where they would pay £37.3 million pounds over three years. However, Chelsea are hoping they will be able to agree terms with the Portuguese side when they meet in Lisbon on Monday. Fernandes has been very public in his attempts to leave the Portuguese club during the January transfer window. His stance remains unchanged and he has reiterated to Benfica that he wants them to strike a deal with Chelsea following their revived attempts to sign him. However, sources have told Sportsmail that the payments in Chelsea's latest proposal are considered by Benfica to be too spread out. The Portuguese club are also reluctant to sanction Fernandes's departure so late in the window unless they receive an offer that is too good to turn down. If a deal cannot be reached to sign Fernandes before tomorrow night's deadline Chelsea are understood to be keen to try and get one pre-agreed for the summer. Something sources say will be more appealing to Benfica. Do you know the Chelsea news on Moises Casiedo? You will enjoy this video on your screen too.